Welcome everyone to the final video in the sci-fi first-person shooter tutorial series. We've officially gotten our project into the state shown in the showcase video and honestly improved a couple systems along the way. For those of you that aren't familiar with the sci-fi FPS series, it's a beginner project that we began on the channel late last year. It takes the first-person shooter template project that comes with Unreal Engine 4 and teaches the viewer over a series of videos how to expand it out and turn it into something that you can really be proud of. We cover a multitude of different topics, all targeted towards beginners, and ultimately the project concludes with the last episode, episode 13. And as promised, with the series being completed, I've uploaded the full project so that you can download it at your convenience. The link will be placed in the description box down below. I've commented around all the scripting in the project and organized it as best as I can so anyone interested in any specific portions of it can simply just look at the scripting to find out how things work. Of course, you'll still be able to refer to the appropriate video for each section as well. I want to thank everyone who followed the series. It really took a lot out of me since writing the scripts and editing the footage were a lot more time consuming than I originally thought. I upgraded the audio equipment and the video quality about halfway through the series, but it's still not perfect. I'm hoping that the quality of videos on this channel will continue to improve over time. This was our only ongoing tutorial series that we currently had on the channel, and with it completed, we'll probably start up another series in a few weeks. I have a few ideas for other tutorial series in the future, but let me know what kind of videos you'd like to watch because those are the ones that I'd like to make. But before we end this finale, let's see if I can beat the game that we made in this series with just the semi-automatic weapon, which is basically on hard mode. Okay, so we have our main menu loaded and ready to go. Let's go ahead and start the game. Like I said, I'm just going to use this semi-automatic mode because the burst mode and the automatic mode are just a little too strong. All right, we got shot twice from the first enemy, second enemy down. Now this guy's in burst mode, so we, we really want to take our time with him. Yeah, he can one-shot us if he uh, hits us with all three rounds. Let's go up these stairs here. Obviously, we know the level because we created it, and we know that there's an enemy down the hall here. Oh, God. Oof. So we're down to one shot. Okay, two enemies in here, both on automatic firing mode, so let's try to strafe ourselves to victory. Alright, we got one. The other one's pretty good, too. Oh! And we got it! <laughs> Alright, I can't believe we actually beat it on the first try. Alright, so that's going to bring us to the end of this series. Once again, I want to thank you for following along and hopefully learning something. If you haven't checked out the series, be sure to take a look. Especially if you're brand new to Unreal Engine, I honestly really think it's a great series for beginners specifically. You should see a link to download the full project in the description box down below, or you can just follow the playlist if you want to start from the beginning to learn along the way. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. I'm Joe Von D, here to help you think like a game developer. Stay tuned for future videos on the channel.